I don't know, Bobby, you haven't been at this too long at the big league level. Is this the wildest one that you have played in? That was a fun one for sure. Yeah, I just had a blast. Went out there, everyone was competing, and it was a fun game. You don't look like anything rattles you, but when you look out there, you see a guy like Trout. You and I talked about that yesterday. Otani, see what they're doing, and then you've got a two-home run, run night. Carlos Santana, what was it like to play in this one? Oh, it was just awesome just seeing what the team did today and going out there just, like I said, having fun, just competing, and this team's very special. I know that there's no give up, but twice you had five run leads and then another one late in extras, and it, it got a little bit dicey. How were you able to keep pushing forward? That's just kind of how baseball is. You just got to kind of take each and every inning, try to win each and every inning, and keep going until the final out's made. That's why I think it makes it so great. All right, it's late here, so we'll let you go. Congratulations on the first career two-home run, first career four-RBI game. Yes, thank you. And now the man that has the the nerves, unbelievable, last man standing, the newest Royal. Not your debut, but you come in here against some guys that you've seen many times before, too. What, what's the mindset coming into that extra innings, 11th inning? Well, I knew it was going to be a, probably a shot, I, and, uh, you know, I got the opportunity to go out there. I knew I was facing the heart of the order. Uh, you know, the offense gave us a little two-run lead there, so a little easier going into that with, the you know, having that little cushion there. You know, I, just, I just told myself, go in, make pitches, and get it out after out, and if a run scores, you know, it didn't matter, and, you know, it ended up going through. Having pitched for a while with Oakland, you've seen these guys, and Trout's had some numbers against you. You know that stuff. I don't need to tell you. So... What are you thinking as you're going up against him? And maybe, again, that cushion helped. I mean, the pass is the pass. Mono y mano right there, him versus me. And, you know, my, my job there is to get him out, pop him up or a K or a ground out there and got a good count. And, you know, I think he was sitting a little soft on me and had been throwing him kind of just junk the whole at bat and, you know, brushed him off a little bit. And I was just kind of challenging him with the heater there, and we got him. You know, I asked Bobby if this is the wildest game he played, and it was a rhetorical question. He hasn't been in the league that long. You've been here longer, but in the last week and a half, you show up in Kansas City as, as a new Royal on the taxi squad, wearing an NBA uniform, end up back in the Bay Area, making your Royals debut, see Alcatraz, and now pitch in this one. How would you sum up the last week and a half? It's been awesome. You know, I can't. Being in the big leagues is a dream come true, and just to be back is awesome, and just to get the opportunities to be put in these big situations. You know, I want these situations. I want to be put in the game when, you know, it's hard of the order, Trout Otani. You know, that's the, that's the, those are the moments you live for. Certainly the best mustache on the team. Also, ice in your veins. Great job tonight. Congratulations. Thank you very much. All right, Daniel Mengden.